is he a farmer or a painter? Um, he's someone that balances both very well. Painter that farms. <laughs> <laughs> um, painter, for sure. Alan's grandfather was seriously into farming. Alan's father was moderately into farming. Alan is a painter who farms on the side. Sometimes I say I'm in the 1%. That's 1% 1 of people who were born on farms in New England during World War II are still on that farm. I knew when I was 20 I wasn't going to make a living farming, but I wasn't going to leave it either. I think there is a sense of responsibility and stewardship that comes with being 12th and 13th generation on this property and this farmers on this island. We all knew that you have to be nuts to be a painter. They'd starve to death. He would arguably be the most important vineyard landscape painter. When I see his paintings, they're like friends. They're like family. They're like beloved pieces that I need to see. They're food for me. I think nature has the answers. If you want to be a scientist or if you want to be a, almost anything in this world, you look to nature to find your answers. It sounds deep, or maybe it doesn't, but it isn't. Understand that. I'm not a deep thinker. I'm not a, you know, I'm kind of a blue collar kind of guy. I just like what I see and I try to paint it.